second test of the uh, FS200 and also the test of the completed battery operated 9JY record player. In battery operation, running off of a eight AA batteries, broadcasting in FM stereo to that little radio right there. Not the best fidelity in the world from that radio, but the sound quality of this is very good. I'll demonstrate this later today in the uh, in the minivan outside. All the operation is exactly the same as it was when it was new, and uh, the same power control right here. This is no longer a volume control, it's just an on-off switch. And we have a speed control now here. In case you have any 16 RPM records you want to play, you could actually. And you could almost play 78s on it. Man, are they fast changing. Love them. The RP-168s are very... Uh, people don't appreciate them. I mean, the brass turntable is gorgeous. You only have this on the very first edition, and they went to a cheap painted look. But these will polish down. They're brass plated, not solid brass. But they have a very thick brass coating, and uh, they look real good polished up. Now I'm going to try this under extreme low light without. Well, that's too. Well, that's just a table lamp. better that way. And in case you think there's any trickery going on as far as being a battery operator, we'll disconnect the battery right now. And there you go. Radio went back to static. And this thing stopped. Now we're going to connect the battery again. And there you go. And there's no wires behind it. See? No trick. Look, ma. No cord. So there you go. Imagine going to a car show with this. That'd be so cool to pull this out of the back of your car and broadcast to your uh, neighboring cars. A little uh, white wire. Here's the antenna right here. You can extend it if you need more range. Now let's look at the underneath of it now. All right. Now let's see if we can break the needle off. <laughs> Only kidding. Anyway, let's take a look underneath this thing now and how different it looks. There we go. Here we have the DC motor with a speed control, the FM stereo broadcasting module, and my own homemade preamp module. And this will this will work with either a magnetic cartridge or a ceramic cartridge. And the wiring. There's two regulators in here. Underneath here is a, is a small is a uh, uh, what you call it a 3.3 volt regulator that the transmitter needs to operate on, and there's a 12 volt regulator underneath here for everything else, so that you can put an AC adapter on this or a car use it in a car without uh, worrying about overvolting it or anything. And so anyway, that's it. That's our 9JY battery operated.